guys, so today I'm coming at you guys with another tutorial. So I'm super excited. We're gonna start with the face, of course. Instead of using a brush, like that's so like 2016. What we're gonna do is use something else. Should I try this? Hmm, what random object can I use inside my house to put my foundation on? Ah. Ah. Duh, a sweet potato. What we're gonna start off by doing is just applying some foundation to the sweet potato. So you're just gonna squeeze like so, and then you're just gonna blend this out. Look at that, perfect, like, perfect. So make sure you blend it really smooth and take your time. Your sweet potato is so sweet to you because <laughs> it even does your makeup for you. <laughs> now I'm gonna totally skip the rest of this process just because you obviously know this isn't working that great, so now I'm gonna actually use a brush like I'm supposed to. But I'm gonna cut this part out. Da, 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 da. Oh snap, I'm not supposed to be recording. So now that you use your sweet potato to blend out your makeup, look how perfect it is. Oh my god, I should have been trying to use this. I'm sure there's so many other fruits and vegetables in my refrigerator or my cabinet or on my counter that will work just as great as this. Who needs a brush? <laughs> so I don't know, for some odd reason, it's still really a trend to use really light concealer. So I'm just gonna go ahead and use medium because this is like the perfect concealer color for me. You're just gonna blend this out. Like, don't worry about it. Facetune fixes everything. Now we're gonna do the most exciting part of this tutorial. My life! Who doesn't love unicorns? Like, who doesn't love unicorns? I love unicorns. Like, I didn't just become obsessed with it just because everyone's in love with unicorns all of a random sudden. I have to, like, go all unicorn out. So, let's get it started. You can't have a unicorn tutorial without unicorn colors, so. <laughs> I just wanna grow up and be a unicorn. Like, literally, that's what I wanna do. Okay, so in order to do a unicorn eyeshadow tutorial, of course you have to use all the unicorn colors. So you have to use pinks, greens, oranges, baby blues, everything that screams unicorn. We're gonna start with warm and fuzzy because that just sounds like super unicorny. And I'm just gonna put that all over my lid. Gonna add some baby blue randomly in my crease. Don't even worry about blending. Just like use all the unicorn colors. Like, it's just about the unicorn. It's not about anything other than that. I just wanna use every unicorn color possible so that you know that's what I'm doing. I'm following the unicorn trend. Duh. Unicorn! <laughs> Chill that face out, girlfriend. Someone literally told me that boyfriend brows are in and they said my eyebrows are boyfriend brows. So like, that's cool and everything, but I'm gonna take it up a notch and I'm actually gonna do something totally different. Something that like, is so bomb that like, you're not even gonna know what hits you. And you're just going to start by filling your brows in. Like that. I know it looks so crazy, but wait. You're just going to basically just make mountains. Like that. You see? And then you're just gonna like fill it in. Like, just fill it in, you know? I don't know what's wrong with this one, but like, <laughs> squiggly brows, like if you haven't heard of squiggly brows, bro, you're not living life. Look at that, like, yes, come true. You don't know what type of facial expression I'm making because my brows give you like, so many different things. Like this brow was like, serious, but this brow was like, I'm doing whatever I want. Okay, so now it's time obviously to highlight and I'm going in with my Mana Glow highlighter and what better way to do this other than to do a hundred layers of it who who raise your hand raise your hand <gasps> i'm doing it a hundred layer challenge <laughs> here we go okay so now that i completely wasted like the majority of my highlighter i put a hundred layers of my highlight on yes hundred layer challenge <laughs> hashtag hundred layer challenge highlighter pretty much going now use the whole bottle or whatever <laughs> you know what why don't I just do 100 layers of mascara too? Oh my God, I don't think anybody's done that on YouTube. Think of all the likes I'll get. <laughs> Can't wait to get them likes and views. So fortunately for me, the lining your lips outside your line has not actually went out of style. So I actually can continue to do that this year. So I'm just gonna line outside my lips again. Don't worry, it was a trend last year, but it's still in, we're still doing it. Don't worry, no one will judge you. Yes. Instead of just aligning outside the lips, I actually went and got a plumping lip gloss too, so it's like the best of both worlds. So we're gonna put this on as we plump them, okay? I refuse to believe anybody knows I line outside my lips. Like, it's so natural looking. But we're not gonna keep it like that because the newest, biggest trend actually is lollipop lips. If you don't know about lollipop lips, then like, you're like, so 2016. So, in order to create lollipop lips, you have to actually look like you sucked on a lollipop and that your lipstick got messed up. Do it on one side, because this is the side that I would've had the lollipop on. So you're just gonna smear it a little bit. Now you're gonna take some like wispy like lashes like so. You don't wanna use anything too drastic. And then you're just gonna cut the lash in half like so and then stick it inside your nostril. Yeah, inside there. Get it in there. Yes, nose, hair. <laughs> I 
Oh, they're good, they're good. I thought my nose hair extensions came out. <laughs> Flossy. So last year it was all about freckles or whatever, but this year it's still about freckles, but now it's glitter freckles. Feel me? Unicorning your freckles. Like a unicorn freckles, get it? I unicorn my face and now I have unicorn freckles. <laughs> now that I have glitter freckles, or somewhat like that because I don't really have like glitter or whatever to like do it the way I wanna do it. But this is still cute or whatever. Okay, so let me just go put on my wig. I'll be right back. But obviously it's not gonna be popping if it doesn't have glitter roots. So you're just gonna dump a whole bunch of glitter on your roots. Yeah, glitter, yeah, yeah. You see my glitter roots, they're so popping like I don't know what I was doing before I had glitter roots. Like, I don't even know. We're just gonna go ahead and do some baby hair. That's like major key. Everyone uses got to be, so I got to be using it too. But the, the whole like trend now is like baby hair all over your face. So I'm just gonna take this whole thing right here, like that, and then just do a swoop, like right on my forehead. Cause I haven't seen anyone do that yet. Yes. <sighs> baby hair on fleek, on, on fleek. Ah. All right, so now that you got your swoops and stuff on your forehead, and that is it, you better take your picture or whatever, so let me get a good picture or whatever. My camera trying to play me low-key. I don't look like this, I look better than this. Ah, so my phone trying to say I look like this, but wait till I hit that face tune though. Face tune fix everything. Face tune fix everything. Face tune can take you from a zero to a 10 with two swipes of a finger, okay honey? Two swipe. It seems like everybody's like over smoothing their face, so like you can't even see their features. So you gotta make sure that when you smooth out your face on Facetune, you smooth everything out. Like no one wants to see that your nose comes out. Like make it look like it's flat and in your face. That's how you do it. That's how it should be done. Don't ask me. I didn't make the rules, okay? I just follow trends. No one needs lip fillers when Facetune will do it for you with them Kylie Jenner lips. <laughs> Glitters in my throat. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this tutorial or whatever. Me showing you all the hottest, latest trends. Thank you for following me and subscribing to my channel to keep up with all the new things that's hot. Like the nose hair, that is just so fly. And squiggly brows. Squiggly brows? Why didn't I think of that? Why? Like why didn't I think to draw squiggly lines on my brows? And honestly, you can accentuate it in Facetune. Like, even if you can't actually draw, you can actually fix it in Facetune and no one would know the difference. Thank you, Facetune. I can't, I just, I. I just cannot. I just want you to know these goddamn nose things itch so bad. <laughs> Who thought of this? Who? Y'all may not see all this glitter that I just dashed in here. It's in there though, bro. It's in there. I don't know who's coming out with these trends, okay? I'm gonna need you to chill because it's getting real hectic and y'all is out here looking low-key kind of crazy. I'm gonna let you live your life. Be you, be who you want to be, but we get it, okay? I'm gonna need these to cut it out and not go into 2018. I'm just saying. Stop putting your makeup on with random objects in your house. It's not right, okay? It's, it's, stop. Just stop. The whole clickbait thing on YouTube and Instagram, <sighs> leave that in 2017, okay? Let's, let's try that. You wanna try it, maybe? The unicorn stuff? Bro, we get it. But y'all wasn't checking for unicorns last year, okay? Unicorns was not on your agenda January 1st, 2017 until somebody, I don't know who, said, ooh, unicorns is in. Now everybody's like, oh my God, unicorns, 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 unicorns. Stop, leave it in 2017, please. I don't wanna hear about any unicorns. I don't want Starbucks making unicorn drinks. Stop it, brows. Now y'all know how I feel about brows. Oh my God, all these little brow trends, I literally have people telling me, oh my God, Linda. How do you do the boyfriend brow? I don't do any boyfriend brow, I just got some thick ass Drake brows. It's not a boyfriend brow for me, this is my real life, bro. But then somebody said, Linda, hey girl, can you do the squiggly brows? Huh? <laughs> you want me to do the what? No, I'm not gonna do the squiggly brows, bro. Where am I going? Where am I going? Not for likes, bro, bro. Nah. The 100 layer challenge. How many products did y'all really waste doing the 100 layer challenge? I'm just saying like, wow. Leave the 100 layers to, uh, I don't know, something else. Just just not on your face. It looks uncomfortable. This itches. God, I just feel, I honestly feel like I just need to wash my whole face and just my whole body. I just, I, I, I can't. <sighs> Lord Jesus. Black girls. Glitter roots ain't for us. So now I gotta figure out how I'm gonna get all this glitter on my hair. <laughs> Bro, can we leave the glitter alone? Not in the roots, baby, no. Not in the roots. <laughs> all right, y'all, I'm 
done for the night. I just had to get this in. Y'all know it was coming. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Share it with all your friends. And wish me luck getting this glitter out of my hair because I'm a black girl. And mm -mm, these box braids ain't getting wet, hunty. So like usual, I hope you have a marvelous day or night, whatever time it is. And I shall see you later. Tough.